<laughs> the first cows in there. Nice one, dude. Big old bull cows. That's a pretty one right there, guys. Check him out. Probably a good 12 inch fish. Gotta get the boat turned around. So the guys that better boat actually sent me this uh, bilge pump and what I want to use it for is to fill my live well up so we're gonna stick it right there Just gonna pump it like this definitely working There we go. Didn't take long at all. We got enough water to keep these fish cool. Because it is about 80 degrees today. So, you know, having them on just a normal stringer or something doesn't sound too pleasant to me. That one's an aggressive one. I don't even know what that is. That's a big shell cracker. <laughs> that was a nice shell cracker. I don't know if he came out of there. They got him peeing all over me. A nice one. You come home with me, buddy. That might be what what suspended right there no give her a couple more throws and see what we do there you'll see all them fish over there they're 25 feet that way i really don't want to get close to them it seems like when i get close to them they run away so i'm gonna try to stay as far as i can away from them not making much noise so they're in the vicinity of that post over there just like they were on the other side i'm actually going to turn the boat around so i don't scare them if y'all liking the video make sure y'all hit the thumbs up button for me we're on that road to 10k subscribers and I mean, I enjoy just what I do. And I couldn't ask for a better life, honestly. It's all thanks to you guys. All thanks to the jig purchases. Watching the videos, liking the videos, subscribing to the channel, all of that. And that's all y'all. There he is. Another nice one. Play him out. Oh man, that's a real nice one. Come here, buddy. Oh, you got me wet. A real nice one right there. I'm saying these fish are so skittish. Yeah, that's a freaking hee-haw right there. Hee-haw. Spawned out, Billy. See if we can get.
get another one out of there. Which I mean, I guess is honestly not. I think I had a bite there. Not 100% sure the wind's starting to blow me in there, so. Try to get another one out of there before it gets completely ruined. Part. I got my net with me, but I got like 10 bass rods on top of it. That is just a freaking good one. Another good one. Shoot down this other side while the boat doing what it's doing. Turn to the back around. All the ones we're gonna catch off of this post. Also a big catfish running through them too, so that's not really helping the cause. Now we're gonna spin around and Go hit the other one, see if we can get off it. I mean, I'm not trying super hard to get the limit. Just bring home enough to eat. So we've already pretty much got that much. But I am gonna hit all of these little, but I'm, I'm, I'm hitting the same thing on each one of them. That seems to be where the fish is pull about three or four off of and I mean I may be able to come back through and repeat it I'm not sure we'll have to check it out and it's just right on the not even on the end but right before the end so we don't need but probably I don't know about two more we'll have a good limit if I do say so myself Here we are, we're approaching it. Yeah, this one's right there. This, I think this is about the most fish I've seen on one so far. So we might be able to pull off a couple on this one. Oh. Had a bass or something come up behind us. <laughs> I got bit as soon as I got in there that time. There he is, a little one. A little brim. I know the bigger one than that in there. Bad cast, but we're still gonna let it fall. That should be one right there.
There we go. Strong fish. Ain't as big as the other one, but still a nice fish. Yeah, this one over here is stacked with fish, honestly. <laughs> Keeper in here, like another male. A nice one. Got a, got a boat coming behind me, so I do that one real quick. <laughs> okay, we have found the mother load, guys. <laughs> There is fish on this brush pile. We just wasn't looking at them right. You know, they're, they're not like all super quality fish, but good eater size, definitely. Now we just gotta figure out how to get to them. Which there's a couple holes in this dock right here. There's one right there. Oh, he got off. Darn it. Yeah, we should be able to limit out right here, no problem. No problem. Postponer. Oh, he broke me off, you joker. You wouldn't even that big. Full nine inch though. Another one for the box. We ain't trophy hunting. We grocery hunting. So that means he followed it for a while. Trying to sneak up on the back of these bigger ones. They seem to be right up under that thing. About four foot. I'm creeping on through them real quick. See what happens. There he is. <clears throat> Not a big one, but a keeper. Thing. Let's see. Yeah, a nine and a half inch. They just post ball. I don't look like it. Shoot it back up under there. There at the top of the water, man. <laughs> Another male. Nice one. 